So today we will be solving another lead code problem using PASH that is lead code 193 valid phone numbers. So in this problem uh, what this means what this says is that we will be given a file named file.txt and we will be having a list of phone numbers in different formats. So for the phone numbers can be in different formats like these mentioned but the only valid formats are this and this. So what uh, here what we have to do is we have to extract out all the phone numbers that are in valid formats for example if we take this file then this does not then this matches this so that means it's a valid number this does not match any of this or this so it's not a valid number this matches this uh, this matches this so it's a valid phone number so we print out this and this um, so we, first we will do is we will create a regex here one regex will match this and the other regex will match this so i've created two regex beforehand so this regex matches this and this regex matches this so um, let's try to solve this problem first using grep so grep is helps us to uh, match the text in a file match the text in line using regular expression matching so we'll give here this uh, e stands for extending regular expression matching and we will point to variable first first regex1 so this is the syntax that helps us point to different variables in our bash file and since we also want to match our regular expression 2 so we will pass in again another e and give it regex2 and lastly we will give it the file from which to read different phone numbers let's submit it and see if it works and it does it's pretty efficient let's also look at different solution let's also try to look at awk as well um, awk is a text processing tool uh, which helps us manipulate and extract text based on different expression matching or based on different format so here we will again use these uh, regular expressions so like i'll just copy this regular expression so we can group different regular expression using the slashes so i'll group the expression using slashes and i'll give it a pipe symbol a pipe symbol indicates either this regular expression or the regular expression that comes after it so i'll again copy this one i'll paste it here and i'll give it command print so that it prints the expressions that match that it prints the phone numbers that matches these expressions i'll remove some of the patterns here uh, i'll remove the forward slashes here which are necessary uh, and i'll remove the slash yeah. uh, here i'll give it a backslash remove the forward slash I'll give it a backslash and we don't need forward slashes here okay I think it's fine now um, okay we need this forward slash after this yeah so now let's try to run this and see if it works and it does and it's pretty efficient too we can use uh, SED as well I'll just copy this because it will be almost same. So SED is again an a uh, text processing tool. Uh, it stands for stream editor, and we can suppress the logs here, and uh, we can suppress the logs here, and we can use regular expression matching using minus e, and then we can instead of specifying print in curly brackets, we can use just p here, and then let's submit this and see if it works. And it does too and it's very efficient as well so uh, i hope you understood the video thank you so much and we'll see you in the next one bye bye